Hi there, I'm Jay Stevens from 94.5 The Bulls Bullpen. Now for some ungodly reason, our general manager wanted me to give you some sort of a virtual tour of what happens on a day-to-day -day basis at the radio station to break down the stigmas. Everybody thinks that it's all fun and games here at the Bowl and, you know, everything happens behind the scenes the same way it does over the microphone and really, it's not that cool. So my water bottle and I are going to give you a little bit of a backstage tour and show you around and introduce you to some people that are not near as cool as I am. So come on. Okay, so now you're essentially in the belly of the beast. This is the entrance to the bull's lair, the deep, dark dungeon in which we hang out. It's actually not deep, it's not dark, it's not a dungeon, it's two stairs down that way. But before you get there, you have to go through this gal, Sue at reception. Sue's basically the hardest worker within the building, and she harnesses all the calls here. Hi there, Susan from the mall. Oh, I'm not taking any complaints today at all. All right, so you just met Sue in front. Okay, she's fantastic. She's great at harnessing complaints as long as you don't have one. Come on in here. This is the jog lounge here. This is where all the jogs put together their shows when they're not on the air. As you can see, there's only Ted in here hanging out with them, all his friends. Ted is a huge UFC MMA fan, mixed martial arts, he's got his finger on the pulse of it. So I'm going to show you today, along with Ted, how to execute the perfect sleeper hole. Okay, okay you know what you're doing, right? Yeah, I've done this before. Okay, all right. I trust it's you. Called, it's called parenting for the 21st century, man. Okay, what do I do? What do I got to do? Uh, so I'm just I'm going to take my arm across like this. Sure, then. This... And then I'm just going to put this arm here, I'm going to hold my bicep here, and then, so you just keep it tight, and see? Look at this, see? See? He'll wake up shortly, just in time for a show. Let's, uh, let's, let's run this way. All right, so we're going to head out to the newsroom as we can see this grandiose virtual tour, and we'll see if Russ Courtney is wearing some hetero street clothes. Oh, coincidentally, he's not. It looks terrific. Russ is, by the way, doing news this afternoon on the bowl, and then he is ship leaves port later on this evening. Steve Saverin, John Chippa, new girl. No, I'm just kidding. That's cute. She's the uh, new staple of all time. Um, must need energy. Sorry. Mac is working really hard on yeah. keeping up to date with who's on her Facebook. Don't look! Huh? Not that it really matters at all. It keeps us on the leading them. edge of society and what's going on. Yeah. She loves Kanon, um, Bach. Nah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Let's keep going. All right, as the grandiose tour continues, we're going to head on over to the Grand Poo boss office, all right? This is the big boss man, all right? So he's probably busy working on budget stuff and all this other crap, so we're going to try not to bother him too much. Driving long, driving long, driving long. Oh, my God! Apparently he's running a car into Nick Lindstrom. Don't hurt Nick Lindstrom, man. He just oh. signed the one-year extension with my Red Wings man. Look at all the toys that you have up here, John. It's all right, give me a big toy. I've got a bobblehead. Bobblehead, please. Bobblehead. The Mark McGuire. Uh, it's a Pez, actually. It spits out steroids. <laughs> <laughs> so how's your Friday going, Don? Pretty good, but uh, the rain sort of disrupted the golf game a bit. I was kind of hoping to get out and play uh, what's he big. What is, what is that? What's that all about? whatsoever. Steve, we've accomplished everything we have to. Where Let's that continue going? the tour, Where shall we? Let's... Alright, you've seen pretty well everywhere behind the scenes of the bowl, and you realize that it's no different than your workplace, minus a couple drunken instances, but that's neither here nor there. And by the way, Ted is doing fine. We sent him down to the hospital just for some preliminary checkup stuff. Um, and I don't know where the hell my water bottle went. In any case, last but not least, let's take you into the belly of the beast. This is the Shut Up and Rock Workday. Drew Stefani, your host. 
prepping hard as always. What's going on, Drew? How are you guys doing? Man? So, what's, uh, what's up? Yeah, you know, I'm just playing a little Red Rooster. Mm -hmm. So, uh, show? What's coming up on the show today? I was thinking about maybe, uh, learning tumbling dice on the Rolling Stone. So I think it goes something like this. Yeah, it's an open G tuning, so... Okay, with, with anything show related happening on the show today? Wait, let me just get the ending. Okay. Thank you. 